On this day in 1927, a Mexican priest named Cristobal Magallanes was killed by the government. Hello, I'm Father James Kubicki of the Apostleship of Prayer, and here's what I found most interesting about this great modern hero of the faith. He was born to a poor farm family and was a shepherd as a youth. He entered the seminary when he was 19, and after he was ordained, he founded schools, a newspaper, catechism centers for adults as well as for children, and an electric plant to help the local economy. What we see here is the important role the church plays in the lives of all people. Father Magallanes knew that people needed to be educated, but not just in secular subjects, also in the knowledge that would help them live faith-filled lives. But the spirit can be oppressed when the body is hungry and cold, and so he worked for the economic development of his parishioners as well as for their spiritual growth. The time came, however, when the Mexican government began to persecute the church and closed all the seminaries. Father Cristobal opened his own, and when it was suppressed, he formed another and another. And when each one was closed, he conducted classes for seminarians in their homes. On his way to celebrate Mass one day, he was arrested and sentenced to death. As he approached that fateful moment, he gave away his few remaining possessions to his executioners, and he forgave them, giving them absolution. He was not alone in giving his life for his people and for the church. Twenty-one other priests and three lay people are also remembered with him this day. May these holy martyrs intercede for Mexico so that the violence there may end and good economic progress and peace may come.